right, and welcome for a tip for the Swagtron EB6 Bandit. I bought this bike about two months ago, two and a half months ago, off of Amazon, and it originally came with a 350 watt rear hub motor and a 36 volt, looks like eight amp hour battery, two prong, and the battery actually went right here where the water bottle is, the two prong, and then the other side just went to the controller. So, I went on to Amazon and I bought a 48 volt, 20 amp hour. You definitely don't need a 20 amp hour. I just bought the big one. And this is also a two prong positive and negative. So basically what I did is I took out the old one, I put in the new one. Um, I couldn't, my seat, because of the difference in height, my seat was up pretty high a little bit i mean it wasn't too too uncomfortable but for the trade-off and speed that i got was really worth it so i immediately went from 18 miles per hour as my top speed with this guy to 28 miles per hour top speed with this guy now one thing that is a bad thing about it is i did overheat the motor which it would overheat and get too hot and ultimately would just stop working and I have to pedal it like a bicycle the rest of the way. But I got to narrow it down where I knew that would happen right around 30 miles, depending on how much you know throttle I use and stuff. So keeping keeping track of the mileage and stuff, I was able to to avoid overheating, you know, and having my motor shut down in a spot where I'd have to pedal a long way. But if you want to make your stock EB6 Bandit go fast, throw in a 48 volt two prong battery. Just watch out; it will overheat your motor. Um, Another tip, Bobby Digital.